G'day, I'm Melissa Shannon, founder of DigitalScrapbookingHQ.com and today I'm going to show you how you can avoid getting disconnected files in your Photoshop Elements Organizer library. Here I am in my Photoshop Elements Organizer program and I'm going to switch on the left to the folders view Just by clicking on folders and then I'm going to change to view as a tree. So then all of my folders in the organizer look exactly as they do on the hard drive. Each of these images here in organizer is just a thumbnail that's stored inside the Photoshop Elements organizer database, but it's linked to the, to the actual file on your hard drive. If you move a file outside Photoshop Elements, Photoshop Elements will do its best to find the file. For example, here we've got some grayed out folders where I've moved the folders outside of Photoshop Elements. When I go on this one, you'll see up in the top left, there's a little icon that tells me that my file is missing. But Photoshop Elements is pretty smart and it's pretty easy to reconnect the files. In fact, it's doing it automatically for me. You can see. Now, what if you would like to avoid having these disconnected files? Well, all you need to do is make sure you just move your files within the Photoshop Elements Organizer system. So in this case, if I want to move this folder of images, I can just click and drag it and move it to wherever I'd like it to be. Then I can see that folder is still there. If I just want to move the photos, I can select them all by pressing Command or Control A and click and drag the photos to where I want them to be. So missing files don't have to be a big drama and they're pretty easy to avoid. All you need to do is use the folders view to move around your photos wherever you'd like them to be in Photoshop Elements. If you'd like to know more about Photoshop Elements and using the organizer, head to digitalscrapbookinghq.com slash organize. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.